What's up everybody, Jessica here with Arcade Block. Yes, I haven't done one for, I think, two months? July and August. And I just got August about a week ago, maybe? If I'm correct about that, I get it like within a few days after the month it's really on, or supposed to be on. But um, yeah, if you don't know what Arcade Block is, it's a monthly subscription box for basically... The title says it all, Arcade stuff. Um, gaming. Basically, everything gaming. I don't see anything with like comics or anything really to do with it, unless it's a comic book related game, as in like, I guess you could say Batman and stuff, but other than that, it's just strictly video games, and I love my video games, I've been playing them since I was like 2-3 years old, and yeah, this is basically so far my favorite subscription out there is Arcade Block, because it's basically what I'm about, gaming. I already got the box, but I haven't looked. So let's get started on July. I like it! So far. Oh, and it's a girl! Val. It's a pop. pop. It's Val. And as you can tell, my camera is in a completely different view. It's above you. Something different, something new. You know? I like it. But yeah, that is freaking cool. I'm glad it wasn't a guy. And the rest, no, no, there's two girls. Val, Maggie, then you got the big old waist, Hank, and Marco, Marco Poe, whatever. I always like these pop figures. I think they're so adorable. So we got that, and this is from Evolve. If you guys didn't, you know, notice that. I don't know where it says right there on the top. Evolve. So far, favorite thing. Out of the box. What the word? Micro figures. Three pack. Grab that. I don't even know what this is. Tons to collect. I'm guessing they're little, the little green dudes. Ages four and up. Looks good on foot. Looks good on foot. Oh, oh. oh my god, they're so tiny! I can't get the other dude, because he's like super rubbery and he's not... Oh, oh, oh it's not a dude. What the heck is this? I guess it's like one of their little objects. It's like a little rubber. It's like a firecracker in a way, like they put fire and it kills and it kills, of course. Then you got this dude, I don't know who he is, but he's a little cutie. And the little green dude with his dirty glasses. They're so cute. They don't have anything else, just little, they're like little, little rubber figures. That's cute. I like it. Uh, squishy collectibles. Yeah, they got squishy. Um, what else is it? I'm guessing it was a game. Based off a game. Leave the t shirts for last. Picking out a couple of things, I don't know what it is. What? Classic console cartridge co coasters. Made in the US. Yeah, it's freaking cool Mario. Chinese Japanese style riding on the top. But they look like paper coasters where like if you bought it, it's just messed up. I'll be so scared to use this. This is like so cute. I like that. Up And DJ Organic. I don't even think I got that right. Um, Mega... Mega Ran... Coin... Oh, crush. Or people. Exclusive. Basically, this is... Just... Game music. Second CD from them so far from what I've gotten. Here's the back. Mm, it's gonna burp it. Burp it. There we go. 
So very, I'm guessing this is like old school basically because it shows the old school gaming thing in the front and you got probably a lot of the songs. I haven't listened to the first one and I'm probably not going to listen to the, the second one for a good while. Let's get into this. Sonic World Unite. That's awesome. I haven't really seen much things, anything about Sonic. I know they got the Corsi games for the cell phone, they got of course the original game is what I'm used to playing from like Sega and stuff. Sorry, that was my phone. And then that's about it. This is series basically with the number one issue. So I'm guessing this is gonna come out once in a while with like different issues from Sonic. That's a cool collectible. T-shirt time. I don't know what this is. I'm gonna show you guys first before I get to see it. Even though I'm kind of seeing it right now, trying to focus it for you guys. This is not the greatest angle, but it's already Star Wars. I already see the dude down there. And I don't know much about it. So, back off, people. But you got, it looks like Dark Vader, Dark Vader, whatever you want to call him in the back. It's like Halloween related, the dark side. Because you got him as the Grand Reaper. And I guess the little soldier dude is supposed to be a skeleton, like a skull head. So, that's cool. I can wear that for Halloween coming out in October. Or to like shows and stuff. And then we got. What? I thought somebody spilled something on my shirt. I'm like, why is it red? Oh, yeah, it's another one. Caution. Is this a crap freaking from Last of Us? A little screecher dude? Screaming head dude? Cricket head dude? Whatever they call him? He looks like one of those dudes. There's his caution. Clickers, clickers or something, and they, yeah, and they, every time they hear noise, they go after you. That's creepy. Oh my god. So there you guys go. That's really what's left in the box, and of course you got the card to let me know what came in the box, and that's just about it. I mean, like I said, if you don't know what Arcade Block is, it's just basically a geek arcade, you know, subscription. You get everything game related, and I love their customized t-shirts. Um... Hope you guys really enjoyed this video, and I guess I will see you in my next video. I really like these dudes. They're squishy. But yeah, hope you guys like this video. If you guys would love to help me, give it a thumbs up. I don't know, up, up. And I guess I'll see you guys, you know, in my next video. And if you're new, subscribe. And yeah, peace.